We think we know what it's like to be in darkness, but we don't. Not complete darkness where all lights have been extinguished. The blind theatre in Buenos Aires provides that experience. We put the audience in a situation which normally the main stimulus is visual. So this person is now disconnected from their phone and other sources of information for more than an hour, having to concentrate solely on what is happening in front of them. But what does the Buenos Aires theatre going public hope to get from the darkness? It surprised me. It was unique, a sensation. I hadn't expected it. When you're in there, it stimulates all your senses. It's fabulous. It wakes everything up, smell, hearing, imagining things you can't see but can understand. Many of the actors and other theatre staff are blind or partially sighted. The work is perfect for people with impaired vision. I'm partially sighted, for instance. At first it was difficult to get used to total darkness, but you do. We saw a production called Luces la Revolución, or Lights the Revolution, a story of forbidden love during Argentina's 19th century fight for independence. There was plenty of sound and movement. I felt the wind on my face and smelt herbs and chocolate. You have to learn how to live in darkness, complete darkness, to, as the theatre slogan goes, see what you can't see. And then, emerging into the light, try to see life with different eyes. There is also a show for children and a pure musical experience, a blind gourmet meal with singing and a comedy. On Saturday, six different shows. There is a feedback from the audience. You feel a development of their perception, not just from their emotions, but you feel their movements, their palpitations. Even though you can't see them, the relationship is still there. It's surprising what you can find in total darkness, illumination perhaps, through the senses that don't see. Daniel Schweiner, Al Jazeera, Buenos Aires.